Mississippi State's uh, Van Studeman and Coach. Final outcome, not uh, what we wanted, but uh, man, your group really, really fought hard for uh, for seven innings this afternoon. What a great ball game in general. Just. You know, you're facing the pitcher who won the national championship last year and you run her from the game. I mean, you know, we just fight. I mean, and you know what? That kid is awesome. You know, she's a great pitcher. And, you know, credit credit our Bulldogs, man. We just fought hard and it was a great game. We started out a little, uh, you know, behind and we just fought the whole time. There was not a doubt in my mind we weren't going to come up and win that game today. So I, I couldn't be prouder for this group. They, we just got to continue to play like this, keep grinding away, and uh, finish the season strong. I've been telling them all along, it's not how you start, it's how you finish. And uh, we're, we're, we're coming in that home stretch right now. And, man, you've got to love the grit and grind of, of these Bulldogs. A lot of teams down five early on in this situation, in, in this atmosphere, uh, might have folded. And at no point did the Drew team fold. And, in fact, kept, kept getting opportunities and kept cashing in and uh, multiple times came back to uh, make this thing uh, very dramatic in the final innings. Absolutely. How much fun was uh, Bree Bell's yes. home run and, and the, uh, for Shape to get on base? And I mean, you know, just a lot of wins. And, and people don't even realize sometimes it's just like laying off of a pitch that that's a win that we celebrate. And we celebrate the wins, all the little wins that add up in this ball game. We won so much today. We won so much today. Just little things, and the scoreboard doesn't show it. But our kids can go home tonight and, and put their head on the pillow and pass that pillow test. They were excellent, and it didn't fall their way. It just didn't fall our way. And that's, that's how it goes sometimes in life, in the real world, and in sports. And in sports, we learn th so much, so much about life. And you know what? It didn't fall our way, but you got to love our fight, and you got to love, we celebrate in those little wins that we had today. And we had a lot of them. Offense, I thought, was really sparked in uh, that fourth inning by Laura Nichols. Uh, a, a great at bat for a, a freshman who also defensively might have grown up some today. Absolutely. You know, uh, she had, we bet we were begging her, make an adjustment, do something different, do something different. I think she had five, four or five outs recorded to the third baseman, one hops. And, um, you know, she's still one step from being safe on those plays. And we're, uh, we just keep telling her, be, be a little bit earlier, be a little bit later, do something a little bit different, and uh, let's make an adjustment. Hit it up the middle, let's just make a slight adjustment. And, and she did it when it mattered most, and we had speed all over the bases, and we were able to get two, two runners across, and it was huge for us. You mentioned Bell's home run. Cooley again, second day in a row, got a hold of one. I mean, you know what? She's hot at the right time. Uh, she, I say it all the time. She's one of those kids that believes, and she's in the she's in the indoor hitting by herself all the time, working hard, and she just believes. And uh, I, I couldn't be happier for her, just for her, because uh, she's just she loves softball and um, she loves her team, and uh, just j j just really really getting hot at the right time. The entire team, offensively especially, seems to be finding their groove right now as we get into the last couple of weeks of the season. Absolutely. I mean, Reach and Mullins have been just hammering it in the bullpen. and I mean, not the bullpen, the indoor facility and on the field. I mean, we've been hitting and, and tweaking and videoing and just all over it. So these girls are buying into that system. I mean, 10 hits today against the, normal, uh, the former national champion. I mean, that's, those are hits. That's not, you know, errors. So, I mean, that's 10 hits. And uh, you got to tip your hat to that. Man, that was awesome. You mentioned, Coach, and this is the last question I have for you. You mentioned all the little, the little wins. No more victories. Uh, we wanted to win more than just the one. Uh, but we gave ourselves, I think, a lot of opportunities to go back and watch film and go, wow, we're playing some really good softball at certain times. Let's keep putting this together now. Here on the home stretch. Absolutely, that'll be a key. That'll be a key to the finish of the stretch here. If we play like this every day, uh, I, you know, good, great things will happen. We might fall short on that scoreboard, but we will continue to grind. And if we play like this, there, there's a bright future for us in the last latter half of the season into June. I'm real proud of them. Coach, thanks for coming up here. Thank Let's you. Game.